In this video, we're going to create a custom tool for the circumcenter of a triangle. So I create a triangle in counterclockwise order, and then I select my perpendicular bisector tool, tool. That's over here, right? You see all the perpendicular lines. So I go to perpendicular bisector, and where the bisectors of each side meet is our circumcenter. So I'm going to move this around a little bit. And we want to select our intersection tool. That's the intersection point of the three lines. That's point D. And over here, we can change point D so it's named as the circumcenter. And that's it. Um, all we have to do now is go to our custom tools. The output object and the focus here is the circumcenter, so I'm going to select that. The input objects are points A, B, and C. We want to call the tools the circumcenter tool. All right, makes sense. Under tool help, we'll say click on three points. And we do want to show it in the toolbar. There's no special icon, but you could add one and then click finish. So now the tool has been created successfully. We're going to clear this off, see that it works. And the idea is that, um, let me just use the tool here, click on three points. Click one, two, three points, and it gives you the circumcenter. Although since we're focusing on triangles, you might imagine the point at which you would use this tool is after you have a triangle. So imagine you're constructing something, right? And you want to find the circumcenter of this triangle and this one, let's say. What would you do? Well, you, you use the tool you just made. And that's why we don't want it to construct a triangle because the idea is you're using this tool on a triangle that's already been made. So first I'll find the circumcenter of F, E, and G, and it finds it over there. It's point J. But what if I want to find the circumcenter of this triangle right here? Well, there it is. It's point K. Now you can change this tool to also show the bisectors and the triangle uh, if you wanted to. Right? It could just be you click three points and then it creates the triangle and the perpendicular bisectors from that. But here we're just creating the circumcenter. Um, if you want to save this tool, right, you go to tools and then um, under manage tools, your tools right here you just made, you just want to save it, circumcenter, click save, and the next time you open GeoGebra, you go to file and open and you find the tool that you just made and it'll open it in the toolbar up here and that's how you keep this tool and you don't lose it. Alright, thanks. Hope this helped.